hello and welcome to my channel this is d from crystal crafts with d today i'd like to show you my latest um, diamond painting that i will be getting started on this is diamond dots diamond art from i got it from dotsdirect.com.au comes in these beautiful boxes it's got your design on the front which i absolutely love nice sturdy boxes and on the side it tells you your dazzle area it is a partial and on the other side you've got your complete canvas and up the top here it tells you it's advanced and I'll just show you on the bottom so on the bottom there it tells you all your specs so your design size is 42 by 37 centimeters and your fabric size is 50 by 45 so it's a nice really nice size this one and lotus so we'll get stuck into this one now that it actually comes sealed but i've just snipped those oh it's hard to get into oh. so you have your drills and your canvas and the all right, we'll pop those drawers over there. So your canvas comes in a dust cover, a plastic sleeve. Oops. And your uh, canvas here, I love how they've got that scalloped edging. I just love that. That's so nice. And you've got beautiful, beautiful canvas is nice and pliable i'm just going to fossick in here and pull this guy out so inside every diamond dots kit you will get um colored instructions pictures and languages all different languages so let's have a look at our canvas is it the right way up nope it's upside down Ooh. Oh wow, that is gorgeous. Whoops. That is so pretty. Alright, so I am just going to roll this back a little bit. It is poured glue, so I can roll it back. I'm just gonna do this so it can sit a bit flatter while I do this. A little bit better so that little kink that'll all relax down once it's all, all out and sitting there that'll flatten out I'm not concerned about it so that is just gorgeous wow I really like that and it's perfect size too so on your canvas you have down the bottom there if I can get that in there it tells you uh, your products so your lotus your size, your fabric size, and your thumbnails. And you have two simple keys, one in your bottom right-hand side, one on your top left-hand side, which I really like. So you're not having to look over the canvas when you're drilling. I do love that. That looks, wow, so pretty. Let's zoom in and have a look at the drill field. So nice and crystal clear. Lots of symbols on that one. They are all symbols except for two letters. But that's looking really, really good. And one thing I love about Diamond Dots, I love how they do the backgrounds. They're, they're blended very, very well. And when you look at along the edging, like there, for example, you've they actually stop the drill field and they have a blended edging all the way around the edging and I really love that because it gives it a really nice finish uh, when you place those drills and it just blends in so beautifully so that looks fabulous nice and crystal clear that you can expect from diamond dots there is your symbol key I'll actually zoom in on the one that's sitting flat because that looks really really good so bring it over to this one there we go so there's your symbol 
key um, you've got your symbols you've got your diamond dots number down the side and Yep, so no issues at all look, looking at that. Nice and easy to see. All right, we'll zoom you back out again. And I'll do a sticky test. Their glue is always so good. Nice and sticky. That is gorgeous. Right, let's flip her over. And we'll have a look at those drills. So your drills come in this plastic bag. It's got design number and design name. And, and, okay. Oh my gosh. So you've got your drills and you've got your toolkit. So your toolkit, it's just a standard toolkit, comes with a single placer, you've got a cushy comfort grip sting, thingy more bob, and you've got your wax in a screw top container. You've got a couple of um, resealable bags in there as well. And you've got your drills. Okay, so we've got it on two strips. Have a look at these guys. So Diamond Dots drills, they are very good quality drills. They're nice and uniform and they're cut. The, those facets in those drills, they just pick that light up and they really do sparkle. So you've got some beautiful reds and oranges and black, dark brown. The mustardy yellow color and green. And you got another green. Some mahogany color, that one. Some dusty pinks. Yeah, I like pink. They're just so pretty. Oh, pinks, pink, 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 and pink. So that's looking awesome. Let's flip her back over again. There you go, there's my lotus. So I'm just going to let that, I'm going to peel the plastic off. When I'm finished with this video, I'm just going to peel that plastic off and I'm going to replace it and, um, that just allows a canvas to relax a bit after being sort of rolled up in the box for a while. So anyway, I'm not concerned about that. So how gorgeous is that? Um, this won't take me too long to, to get finished and I will be framing it and putting it up on the wall. So um, this video will actually have, this is the unboxing right through to the works in progress, through to the review and then the framed product. So, um, that's going to be really good to uh, sort of zoom along with that one and see how we go. So I'll leave you now and um, I'll get stuck into it and I'll see you on the other side. finished didn't this turn out absolutely gorgeous I absolutely love this I love the colors that they've used I was a little bit worried about this sort of bright orange color when I was putting it down I thought oh, I don't know about that but um, yeah look I think it turned out really really well and it all blended so nicely so uh, didn't take me too long to do and um, it had enough like variation in the colors to sort of not get me over pinked but um, yeah look I'm so happy with this turned out absolutely fantastic so I'll zoom you in so you can have a closer look in we go 
lots and lots of beautiful shine it's so pretty gee it sparkles I just thought it came up so well and yeah I mean that is quite bright that orange color but I think it works and I love how it comes out along you know with that beautiful background I just I love the whole thing looks so pretty doesn't look gorgeous I had no trouble with it whatsoever I like how there's a bit of green in there it kind of breaks it up very very pretty so I'll zoom you back out again yep I love it I just think this is so pretty I'm so happy that I got it anyway we'll have a look at the leftover drills I'll flip her over So my drills look so pretty. So I have plenty left over. There's no issues whatsoever. There was um, hardly any static with these drills, which thankfully I was wrapped about. Hardly any there. I think the only one that I got a little bit concerned about was this one here. Um, I wasn't sure if I was going to have enough, to be honest. But um, yeah, look. There was enough, there was plenty, so um, yeah, some of them I had quite a lot left over. But no issues with the drills. Um, I'll show you the reject drills. Where are we? Oh. Reject drills. And of the rejects, I think there was a couple that had little bits stuck on the side and some of them were concave. And some of them don't even belong to this diamond painting, but they were um, they were sort of on the floor, so I just picked them up and chucked them in there. So not very many at all. So there you go. There's my leftover drills. Heaps left over. Put them back over again. There's my Lotus. Absolutely love this. So I'll be finishing this off. Um, I don't think I will seal it. Just depends on how I go. Um, but I plan on framing this one and I still have to get out there and try to find a frame for it The size of this one's a little bit harder to um, To fit in a frame it is a 42 by 37 centimeter and the frames that I've got are too sort of narrow The lengthwise is okay, but finding it sort of that kind of chunky rectangle size is a little bit more challenging so I'll have a bit of a, a look around and see if I can find a frame that will fit this because I do definitely want to hang this up on the wall so there you go there is my pink lotus love this no trouble whatsoever with it and um, came up absolutely gorgeous so thank you so much for watching my video and I will catch you next time bye